The modern Cummins diesel has become one of the most refined, durable, and emissions-efficient powertrains ever put into a truck. And a big part of that progress comes from its constantly evolving emissions system. Whether you drive a Ram Heavy Duty, operate a fleet of medium-duty trucks, or simply want to understand how the latest generation of Cummins diesels keep performance high while staying clean, the 7.2 Cummins emission system is a complex but intelligently engineered package. This deep dive breaks down the full system, how DEF works, why the DPF is so important, what the EGR system does, and the newest updates Cummins has introduced to improve reliability and lower maintenance. And most importantly, you'll get real expert insights on what these changes mean for long-term durability, towing, and everyday ownership. Why emissions matter more than ever in modern diesels. Diesel engines are naturally powerful and efficient, but they also produce higher levels of nitrogen oxides, NOx, and particulates, soot, compared to gasoline engines. As emission standards tighten globally, Cummins has had to strike a delicate balance. Keep torque high, keep fuel efficiency strong, and keep the engine reliable while also dramatically reducing harmful emissions. According to multiple diesel engineering specialists, the latest Cummins architecture focuses on three main areas. 1. Prevent soot from forming in the first place. 2. Capture the soot that does form. 3. Convert harmful emissions into harmless gas before they exit the tailpipe. This is where DEF, DPF, and EGR come together in a coordinated system. 1. Diesel Exhaust Fluid DEF. The heart of NOx reduction DEF is a simple mixture, 32.5% urea and 67.5% deionized water. But its job is massive. It works alongside the SCR, Selective Catalytic Reduction System, to convert NOx into nitrogen and water vapor. How DEF works in the 7.2 Cummins War. When exhaust leaves the turbo and passes through the DPF, it moves toward the SCR system. There, the Cummins calibrated DEF injector sprays a fine mist into the exhaust stream. High exhaust heat breaks DEF down into ammonia, which reacts with NOx in the SCR catalyst. The reaction is simple but effective. NOx plus ammonia, nitrogen H2O, steam, expert insight. Why DEF is your friend, not your enemy. For years, diesel owners viewed DEF as a hassle, but diesel engineers now argue the opposite. DEF allows Cummins to run a cleaner, more aggressive combustion strategy that increases power and improves fuel economy. Because DEF handles NOx reduction downstream, Cummins can tune the engine for better throttle response, more efficient turbo operation, more complete combustion, less soot going into the DPF. In plain terms, more power, less gunk, longer life. DEF updates in the 7.2 Cummins emission system. The newest Cummins DSCR system features more precise DEF injection timing for optimized NOx conversion, improved DEF line heating to prevent cold weather crystallization, a redesigned DEF pump module with better long-term durability, advanced onboard diagnostics to reduce false warning lights. These updates help solve common problems such as DEF crystallization, injector clogging, or system derates due to sensor faults. 2. Diesel Particulate Filter DPF. Capturing soot before it escapes. The DPF is essentially a ceramic honeycomb filter that traps soot particles. Every modern diesel has one, but Cummins has invested heavily in improving both the durability and the regeneration efficiency within the 7.2 emissions system. How the DPF works. Soot produced during combustion gets caught in the DPF's porous walls. Over time, that soot builds up and must be burned off in a process known as regeneration. There are two types. Passive region, when the exhaust is hot enough naturally, typically during highway driving. Active region, when the engine raises exhaust temperature via fuel injection strategies. Expert insight, why regeneration matters. A veteran diesel emissions engineer explains, DPF health is directly tied to engine performance, fuel economy, and turbo longevity. If the DPF is constantly clogged, the engine can't breathe properly. Meaning, a healthy DPF equals a healthy engine. DPF updates in the 7.2 Cummins system. The newest DPF system includes several improvements. Higher capacity ceramic substrate. This allows more, more soot storage without triggering frequent regens. More efficient regen thresholds. Cummins engineered better temperature control so the system can generate just enough heat, not too much, to burn soot effectively. Improved pressure sensors. 
More reliable readings mean fewer false alarms and fewer unnecessary regens, reduced back pressure. This helps improve turbo spool time, low our fuel economy. Experts estimate that improvements in the DPF architecture and software have reduced forced regions for most trucks by 20-25% depending on driving conditions. 3. Exhaust Gas Recirculation EGR The first line of emissions control, EGR recirculates a controlled amount of exhaust gas back into the intake. It's one of the oldest and most important emissions technologies because it lowers peak combustion temperatures, which reduces NOx formation at the source. How EGR works in the 7.2 Cummins The updated EGR system includes a more efficient EGR cooler, a precision-controlled EGR valve, revised sensors and flow monitoring, better routing to reduce soot buildup. By cooling and reintroducing exhaust gas into the cylinders, the EGR system reduces oxygen concentration, lowering combustion temperature and NOx output. Expert insight, the cleanest EGR Cummins has ever built. A Cummins systems engineer recently explained, our newer EGR coolers resist fouling far better than older models. We have focused on preventing soot deposits instead of just dealing with them later. This has big real-world impacts. Fewer clogged coolers, less intake manifold contamination, more stable combustion, lower maintenance costs, better long-term reliability. 4. How DEF, DPF, and EGR work together in the 72 Cummins. Each system has a role. EGR reduces NOx formation during combustion. DPF captures soot before it leaves the engine. DEF SCR neutralizes NOx in the exhaust stream. Together, they create a balanced emissions strategy. According to diesel emission specialists, the key to Cummins' success is that these systems communicate with each other through a unified control module, real-time adaptive strategy. The 7.2 Cummins emission system constantly monitors exhaust temperature, back pressure, NOx levels upstream and downstream, soot load, DEF quality, air-fuel ratio, turbo behavior, EGR flow rates. With this data, the system makes micro-adjustments in milliseconds. For example, if the DPF is approaching soot capacity, the system increases exhaust temps. If EGR flow decreases slightly, the SCR system compensates with more precise DEF injection. If DEF quality drops, the engine adjusts combustion to reduce NOx formation upstream. This dynamic coordination ensures that performance stays consistent even under heavy loads, such as towing 20,000 pounds or long-haul driving. And 5. Common emissions problems and how the 7.2 updates address them. Older diesel emission systems, across all brands not just Cummins, struggled with frequent regens, cracked EGR coolers, DEF injector failures, DPF clogging in city driving, sensor failures triggering limp mode. The new 7.2 Cummins system incorporates redesigned components and smarter software to eliminate these weaknesses. Key reliability improvements. Stronger DF pump module. Better durability under extreme heat and vibration. Longer life EGR cooler, built to resist thermal cycling and soot accumulation. More robust DPF substrate, designed to last the lifetime of the vehicle with proper use. Updated sensors, NOx, temp, pressure. Significantly fewer false codes. Better diagnostic logic, meaning fewer unnecessary D-rates. Smarter regeneration strategy, especially beneficial for trucks used in stop-and-go environments. A Cummins technician notes, the 7.2 emission system has matured. It's no longer a problem area. It's a well-refined component of the engine. 6. How these updates improve real-world driving. Whether you tow, haul, or commute, the updated 7.2 Cummins emission system has clear benefits. 1. Better fuel efficiency cleaner. More efficient combustion means the engine uses less fuel and fewer forced regens reduce fuel waste. 2. More consistent power under load. Lower back pressure and improved DEF dosing help keep turbo response sharp. 3. Longer component life. Less soot entering the EGR and DPF means fewer service issues. 4. Less downtime for fleet owners. Improved diagnostics and higher reliability translate to fewer shop visits. 5. Smoother driving experience. With fewer regions and reduced emissions-related torque fluctuations, the updated system feels seamless. 7. Expert predictions. What's next for Cummins emissions technology? Diesel emission systems will continue evolving, and industry experts predict the next generation of Cummins improvements will focus on even more precise DF injection, possibly with multi-stage dosing for extreme accuracy, lower restriction DPF designs, 
improving power while maintaining emissions compliance, advanced EGR cooling materials, reducing heat stress and soot accumulation, smarter AI-assisted diagnostics, predicting issues before they occur, integration with hybrid assist systems, light electric assist could reduce soot generation under heavy throttle. Cummins has made it clear that diesel will continue to improve, not disappear, and the 7.2 emissions upgrades are proof that modern diesel technology can be cleaner, stronger, and more reliable at the same time. Final thoughts. The 7.2 Cummins emission system with its refined DEF, DPF, and EGR components represents one of the most mature, reliable, and efficient diesel emissions packages on the market. The combination of better materials, smarter software, and continuous engineering improvements has transformed the modern Cummins into a powerful, clean, and dependable engine capable of meeting the demands of both personal and commercial use. With expert insights and real-world data showing improved performance, reduced maintenance, and stronger long-term reliability, it's clear that the latest Cummins emissions architecture is more than just a regulatory requirement. It's a technical advantage.